How's it going, everybody? My name is Wadi, and welcome back to The Walking Dead, the final season. Let's jump right into this. He's gonna let us stay, right? I guess we're gonna find out. Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. Up here! Come on, Clem, this way. Hey, AJ, wait up. Tintu. Hey, Clem. Thanks for the pencils. I missed having colors. Sure thing. Who are these guys? They're firefighters. That one's a policeman. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These were the people who protected us. Where are they? I've never seen one before. They all died a long time ago, trying to save everyone. Oh. They were weak. What? No. They were brave. Strong. Now, give it to me and... No. He's mine now. Hey, give it back. No. You don't even know what they are. Okay, okay. That's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. It's mine. No, it's not. Yeah, for real. Like, what? Fine. <laughs> Thanks. Do you know where Marlon is? I don't know. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. Look. Hey, what'd you find? It's a picture of Marlon and Lewis. They're so little. Wow, they've known each other a long time, huh? Marlon? Stay back. Said dogs brought back bad memories. I'm sorry, I didn't realize you were so scared of them. But I swear, Rosie's not as frightening as she seems. Um, she was just playing Sit, girl. In attack mode. See, she's harmless. She just needs to get to know you, is all. Here, I'll show you. Do you trust me? Heck no. Rosie, shh. Sorry. I promise she's not gonna bite. <sighs> okay, I guess. You could have this get down on her level. Side. Better get your scent. It's okay. She's not gonna hurt you. There you go. Now whistle and tell her to lie down. Lie down, Rosie. We're gonna be able to use her. Oh, yo, come on. I really want to use her in a fight. So cool. See? Not so hard. Yeah, that was pretty cool. And now Rosie will recognize you. She's really well trained. She was the headmaster's dog back when this place was still functional. But when the world went to shit, he bailed. All the other adults did. Left us behind to fend for ourselves. Wow, well, what a dick. <laughs> Understatement of the century. Now it's just us kids left. And I'd like it if you and AJ were a part of that. Oh my god, Both this society is gonna go down. Need that. Here. This is the current state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. The 
greenhouse. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. Had plenty of vegetables growing. But it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. Yeah, we, uh, we keep away from that now. Mm, that sounds a little suspicious. What's out here? Fishing. Oh, that's where we fish. I uh, got a shack for storage right here. Right along the river. It's secure mostly. Get the occasional walker or two come by. Blind Brody should be heading out there in a bit. Yeah, that's the train station. Everything. There was a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed your car. Pretty sure that place a lost cause. There's a hell of a lot of smoke coming from it when we found you two. Walkers flooded in there after all the noise you made. Well, what's the trap area? The hunting grounds, more or less. Lewis built some traps out there to catch game. He and a Sam are set to go check them today. I'm assuming I'll probably. I didn't realize how much forest that. surrounds this place. It's how we've kept ourselves from unwanted attention for so long. Well, for the most part. That's the only road that leads in and out of Erickson. If you go off it, you'll eventually end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but I took them down. I wanted this place to be hard to find. Good. One more thing. You see these red lines? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. It's been getting smaller over the years, and the food's become more scarce. So why not go outside it? someone goes outside the safe zone, bad shit happens. People die or disappear. I just... <clears throat> I could really use the help, Clementine. Taking care of these kids, it's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if, if I don't fix our food situation, I can't lose anyone else. We've already lost so much. Friends. Siblings, I... Let another kid die. We're not gonna let that happen. I promise. <sighs> Thanks, Clementine. I appreciate that. I really do. Everyone's counting on me to step up. Be the leader they need me to be. I really want to be that for them. You and AJ are two more mouths to feed. Maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds, looking for rabbits. Well, Asim will, anyway. Lewis, I uh, just hope he shows up, if I'm really being honest. Violet and Brody are going up river to do some spear fishing. And hopefully, those two get along long enough to get some work done. Both teams could use some extra hands. You know what? I want to hunt. Let's go do some hunting. Use the yeah. skill. Take this. Better than fishing. Don't want you get lost. Thanks. We need all hands on deck if we're going to find any more food. Just remember to stay in the safe zone. We need you to come back home in one piece. So that means we can stay? What? Do you think I was going to throw you out? Maybe. Well, as long as we got enough to eat, you're both welcome here. Go get him, AJ. All right, let's get going. See you around. What happens if they don't have enough to eat? Hunting grounds are usually clear of walkers. Sometimes they get caught in the snares and shit, though. You see a ribbon on a tree, traps are nearby. So watch where you step. Please, I think I can handle myself. I'm basically a ninja, skilled in the craft of martial arts. I'm just gonna let, let him talk. You done? Y'all are no fun. 
We got work to do. Not all of us have the privilege of being Marlin's lapdog. Oh, ouch. Someone's a little jealous. In my defense, I totally get things done. I just prefer to think of survival as more of a day-to-day -day task. So, you know, don't sweat the technique. Hey, look, I don't need approval from anybody. I've kept myself alive this long doing what I'm doing, so... You act nothing, like you're the only one good with strategy. Say, so I'm just Play the long quiet. game. You gotta have plans B, C, and D. And what if you don't make it that far? Shh, shut up a second. He's like a walker pinata. Cut it down, fix the snare, and let's go. I will, I will. Eventually. If you want food for the kid, I could use a hand. Or you can mess around with this idiot and starve. It's up to you. Oh, you can starve. So dramatic. Come to hunt? I hear something rustle around in here. Yeah, let me help you out. For a second there, I was worried you were gonna encourage him. I'll never understand that idiot. You a good shot? Yeah. Good. I'll chase him out of the bush. You shoot. Last time I was out here, it looked like one of the rabbits had some babies. I'm not sure how many are still around, so careful where you shoot. Aim for the parents. Well, yeah, I don't even, worry about it. I didn't even Better press to save R2, our arrow just press anyway. LT. I saw some others run this way. What? BS. Shit. They're such a pain in the ass to hit. Clem! Clem, come here! I'm mad. Look, it got one. It's a baby. Well, all meat is good meat. It's not enough. Release it. Why to get bigger? I'm hungry. So am I. But we'll be even hungrier tomorrow if we don't let him go. Tomorrow doesn't exist, dingus. There's just today. And today I'm hungry. We're hungry. Are you gonna do it? I can't watch. Let him go. Let it get bigger. Think about the future. Bye, bunny. Really? What are we supposed to eat tonight, then? We'll find something. Ah, uh, I get it. I wouldn't want to kill a baby bunny, either. He'll thank me in a few months. If we live that long. All right. Well, the snares have all been reset and are ready to trap things. We good to go now, or what? I guess this is it. Hopefully next time there are more targets. And maybe some sharper aiming. Yeah, sorry. I'll take this back. You two should meet up with Brody and Violet and see if they've managed to snag any fish. This isn't gonna be enough for the whole school. I like fish. That's great. See ya. <laughs> Follow me. The girls are probably near the shack. Do you like fish? I once ate a whole shark. No, you didn't. I'm mad I didn't get the rabbits. It wasn't my fault. I didn't know what I was supposed to do. And I hit LT by accident. And it was at RT, so I guess I didn't really get it. Where's Vi and Brody? They should be here by now. Clem, look. Mm. 
monster. Vi wouldn't have just left this out in the open. Wait, isn't that one of our spears? Clem, locks busted. We might not be alone. Stand back. I'm kicking it open. <laughs> Holy shit! This place is wrecked! All our supplies are gone! I'll take a look around outside. Hold tight. Are we in danger? Maybe. Cigarette. Hand rolled. Is this a Bible page? Clementine? What the hell happened in here? Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Oh, oh, no, no sign sauce. of our thief. Thief? Oh, shit. We just walked a mile of river and the traps were all empty. No fish. None. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. Fuck. That's... Fuck. Fuck. It's just... Fuck. It's okay. It's... Breathe, Brody. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be fine. <sighs> hey, easy. We'll still find enough food to get us just through Just shut the... the fuck up, okay? Oh! Brody, just chill. Oh, she wants to go! Oh, um, all right. I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough here. You guys figure it out. So what do we do? Eat rocks? You can't eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlon kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. Where else could we look? Let me think. The, only place. the train station. It's not too far from here. Uh, I don't know. That's pretty far outside our perimeter. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. All right, fine. Lead the way. Clementine was warned. If something happens to these people, it's on her. That's all I gotta say. I'm actually gonna end that episode there, guys. Thank you all for watching. If you, gotta, if you wanna find out what happens in the next episode, uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Hit that little bell notification so you can be the first ones to find out. I feel like something's gonna happen. Uh, I feel like we're gonna find some people at the train station or somebody's gonna go missing, somebody's gonna die or something because of all this stuff they're saying like, oh, every time we go outside the perimeter, something bad happens. Clementine, she's, just, she's like, oh yeah, let's just do it anyways. What? That being said, See ya.